This video contains a lot of spoilers about the pirate event going on right now in Shadowgun Legends. If you guys want to discover for yourself and find out the riddles by yourself, I suggest you save this video for later and if you get stuck, you can come back. But if you want to know everything about the event and the rewards, keep watching. What is up guys, Johnny here. I'm back with more Shadowgun Legends. In today's video, talk about the pirate event. We're gonna see everything, all the riddles, what they mean, how to solve them, uh, some tips to go faster. We'll look at the rewards and we'll also look at the shop refresh because there's a lot of stuff going on right now. So we start with the Pedro shop. All the bundles are there. The old bundles that were gone for a while, the cat bundle is back. Uh, summer giveaway bundle is back also with the surfboard back uh, I haven't seen that in a while you know the samurai bundle is there anyways the the bundles that are there already usually are still there uh, we got more though now we got the rewards for the pirate event uh, the Jolly Roger emote I thought it was gonna be in the event it is here and we got a new pistol the lusty Betty it's got crazy accuracy and crazy range I have some gameplay later this week right now i'm saving my tokens for a good roll this is still 700 tokens okay so there's something else the hat you see i'm wearing right now the pirate hat uh it was the first part of the event that you had to do if you wanted to get started and start earning some riddles so we're gonna go uh, with the other shops real quick and then we'll talk about all the riddles and what they mean and how to do them so check out big red the Scarlet Bundle is at Big Red for gold, 1400 gold you can buy it. So that thing was gone, uh, it was not. It was only available for low level players, they put it in the shop now, you, you had to buy it with real money, now you can buy it with gold. So if you guys got uh, gold supplies, it's a great buy, okay, it's a full cosmetic set, it looks really good and uh, I'm gonna get one myself for sure. Uh, then you got also the 4th of July paint cans they are back you can buy them for gold 72 gold for for cans stars and stripes and stuff uh really cool paint by the way all right let's go with the pirate event is the hunt for the captain blue balls treasure again and we know it's gonna be a two weeks event now let's see how it started yesterday now first time you logged in yesterday after the start of the blue balls event there was a mission at pedro that says the voice in my hat he says check out my new stuff and he says, I keep hearing voices from the hat. Um, so like, this is the spoiler now, starting now. If you don't want spoilers, stop the video, save it for later maybe. And if you ever get stuck and you don't know what to do, come back, I will explain all the riddles. So let's go with the first one, voice in my hat. All you have to do is go to Pedro and check his new item. It says, check the hat. So if you buy a hat, uh, and this is the pirate hat, by the way, when you buy a hat, it completes the mission now you go back you claim the 1000 fame and he's gonna start giving you some riddles there are five riddles this week and here's riddle number one so pirate riddle one was uh, you had to solve the riddle it says between the eyes is the best place to aim and enough of these hits you must gain now again spoiler alert if you want to solve the riddles for yourself uh, stop watching the video save it for later Riddle number one means you have to get headshots and when you claim the mission it will show a count 0 out of 18 so you need to get 18 headshots in any game mode so guys I just went into the arena bronze arena silver arena you get lots of blinkers they don't I mean they move but yeah the dreads uh, get an accurate weapon I use Nico stopper it's got great accuracy Nordic guard is good for headshots uh, you can use the accuracy on the skill tree but go in the arena or whatever you do you can do it in blue missions and go for headshots guys and then you go back you're gonna get one paint can and another thousand fame but you also get some tokens when you're done you go back to pedro he's gonna give you riddle number two riddle number two says two beasts of fire what are they like one big brute with a hole in the back a denser sword a denser off swords that demands great speed and like bees in a hive choose who to defeat now, if you guys uh, kind of recognize what it means, it's the bosses from each dungeon. And it says, choose who to defeat. All you got to do is go to a dungeon of your choice and finish a dungeon. I don't think you need to actually get the kill on the boss. Because I'm pretty sure we did hive mine and I stopped shooting at the end because I wanted to see. Pretty sure I didn't get the last hit and I still got the mission complete. 
So just do one dungeon of your choice. When you're done, you get a sticker and 125 tokens. Then you get riddle number three. Only you and one other to the death you must fight. Again, that's pretty simple. You and one other guy must fight to death. So it's pretty obvious it is a duel. You have to do a duel, but uh, you need to do two and you need to get two wins. You can do it in friendly duels. If you struggle with duels, if you're not so good in PvP, you can get a friend, do friendly duels. You let him win, then he lets you win. You can trade like that. You, you need two wins. Now, again, you're gonna get tokens and fame. Then you get riddle number four. It says, so many torment in such short time. You will mow down for fun. Shun the weapon that is prime and bust out the machine gun. Now, this one might be a little harder to solve, but it says so many torment in such short time it means you got to kill many enemies fast. That is also known as multi kills in these games. Now, again, they talk about machine guns in the bottom. So you get you need to get multi kills with machine guns. So I went to the I think I did it in gold arena, but you can do it anywhere. You need a lot of enemies at the same place like dreads. Uh, could be blinkers, the gray ones, anything gray with low health. Uh, spider is really good for multi kills. The drones in the arenas are pretty good. Get your machine gun, shoot in a pack, try to get quick kills, and it's gonna give you multi kill. Then come back to Pedro and you'll get your reward two more paint cans and 75 token. Now that would be the last riddle for this week. Riddle number five it says five waves of torment you will defeat whether you're a rookie or an elite or an elite uh, to the place of the fight you must walk just go uh, visit nitro and have a talk so once again you gotta do an arena and it says whether you're a rookie or an elite i think you can do any arena you want i did it in bronze the last one and i got the mission complete 150 tokens and 2000 fame for that one all right when you're done and you talk to pedro again there's a message he said congrats you did all five riddles and he says it's only the half of it and he said, Blue Balls will send me five more riddles next week. So we know the event will last for two weeks. We'll have more later. Now it's time to farm tokens and get the rewards in the shop because you need 1400 tokens for the emote and for the pistol. It kind of looked like a lot, but if you look at it, I got 800 tokens. I didn't even farm that much. Just completing the five riddles will give you hundreds of points. It's almost enough to buy one of the two rewards and you got over a week to grind for the second reward so if you want both rewards it's less of a grind it's a smaller grind than we had the for the easter event was a lot of tokens we needed that event is not too too bad there's not that many rewards but i think there's more to it they didn't spoil anything but i think we'll get more rewards next week when we get five new riddles i don't know if it's gonna be harder but they give you stuff. They give us paint cans. They give us uh, fame. But we might have more. I'm kind of expecting uh, some kind of a treasure or something at the end. And we're still hoping for maybe a, a legendary auto rifle, uh, a cutlass or a new version of Baramundi or something. I don't know. Maybe it's just going to be more paint. But maybe there's going to be something else. We'll have to wait one more week to see uh, the next riddles. Now that's not it. We also have new strong boxes, secret stash from Captain Blue Balls, and the rewards are pretty crazy. We got the Tommy Knocker. It was an SMG that was at Nitro. Look at that second one there. Eldritch Reaper or Eldritch Reaper was one of the Halloween event reward. It was an auto rifle. It's actually pretty good. Uh, it's in the the strong box. And if you scroll down, you have more pirate stuff. Pirate Party Set Cell is the two new camels. And some stickers, also the blue stickers, the pirate stickers. I want to show you guys that paint. I got one strong box. It wasn't the daily missions, by the way. And I think they only drop in daily missions. They don't drop in blue missions. But you guys need to leave me a comment below. If you got a pirate stash, secret stash, outside of the daily missions, please leave a comment below. But check it out. My favorite paint in the whole game. So sadly, I only have one. But check it out large red and black stripes with skulls on it like crossbone skulls and uh, if i put it on the bottom part it looks like that man i think it's really cool and i really hope i can get one more 
maybe it's gonna be the rewards in the next uh, riddles next week but it really looks awesome and i think i want to paint uh, some of my cosmetic sets with that one is definitely my favorite camo in the game uh, i don't know what you guys think leave a comment below but i really like it so hopefully i will get more fingers crossed now that was the artwork we clearly see four different stickers we see the hat we see the pistol we see the new flag and in the background we see uh two camels the two camels the one uh which is the light blue camel is the one we received in the first five riddles and that's why maybe i'm thinking the red and black one which is really the coolest one probably will have as rewards in the next riddles maybe something else i don't know it says july 11 july uh, 24 that's two weeks 14 days and it looks like it's all i don't know if we're getting something else next week but for now pretty sure that's all maybe we have some secrets that we have not found maybe there are some hidden stuff that we will discover this week uh, maybe there's more to it but yeah if you guys find something leave a comment on one of my videos let me know on discord or facebook and i'll definitely look for it well that's it for now thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoyed the video once again leave a comment below don't forget to subscribe for more shadowgun legends news gameplay and guides i will be back soon till then watch my other videos take care Thank you.